Okay. All right. So this is part two concerning the reading that I um, did um, concerning my channel being gang stalked. Um, concerning my channel being gang stalked. And I wanted to go public and do a video and get more into the detail. Um, so I left off by starting with the tarot. So the six of wands came out. So something could be being brought to my attention. Um, the people that's gang stalking me doing witchcraft, dark magic, things like that. Um, this could also be a victory of some sort. This could be my energy or something's being brought to somebody's attention. Somebody could be a narcissist as well, the Six of Wands. And then we got the Five of Swords at the bottom of the deck. So, um, the Five of Swords is pettiness. Them coming up against my channel, it's just, they're being petty. With this witchcraft, dark magic. Um, them being very meticulous and picky. Um, wanting to call me annoying, wanting to cause me to just... It could be very annoying, but I don't pay it no mind. Because I, I know, um, I pick it up intuitively what they're doing to my channel. Certain things they do. So, they five of swords and they trying to, they, they're trying to win at all costs, basically. Wanting to defeat me at all costs. So, the six of, the six of wands was the first card that came out. Give me some tarot about what's going on with my channel. <clears throat> we got the Eight of Pentacles. And this is my card for like, um, like somebody putting in work to defeat someone. So somebody's putting in work trying to defeat someone. And again, like I was just doing the, the other spread, so you in labor. So it's like the whatever they're doing against me and or my channel is very it's very risky. It's very risky, it's toil and labor. Um it's dangerous for them. Not too much necessarily for me, but it's more dangerous for them than for me. This can also be my energy too. Like this could be me working on my channel, doing my readings, minding my business. Eight of Pentacles. This is me minding my business. Um, and they're like bees. Like every once in a while, these bees. This is them. They're like bees. So it's like every once in a while, I feel a poke here, a poke there, or I'll pick up something intuitively, just to confirm my intuition that somebody is doing dark magic, gang stalking, things like that, witchcraft. Is very is very meticulous, and I'm gonna keep saying it because that's what it is. That's what I pick up intuitively. It's very hateful. It's very controlling, but they're very meticulous. But I still catch up. I catch it intuitively. So this could be my energy. Me just putting my work in, minding my business, like I said, doing my readings. Um, eight of Pentacles, just putting work in. <clears throat> they also want me to notice them but they get little to no uh, like reaction from me this could be them like they seek attention they want me to notice them they want me to realize that I'm under attack my channel is under attack and all that they want me to realize it but it's like I can be the eight pentacles they want me to realize it and then we got the five of cups so they're putting the work in to cause me emotional regrets and losses so they want to cause me emotional regrets and losses or they're going to have emotional regrets and losses from their spell work them putting in work witchcraft dark magic they're going to um the, the Five of Cups is what they want to happen to me, or this is what's going to happen to them. Yeah. 
Yeah, then we have justice. Yeah. So let me see something. Is this six of wands my energy? Is this six of wands my energy? Is the six of wands my energy? Yeah, yeah. So the six of wands is my energy. This could be letting me know. Um, the six of wands is a victory. So I have some type of there's a victory going on going on for me, in spite of um these people gang stalking my channel, witchcraft, dark magic. Um, there's a victory going on, and justice is letting me know that I have a right to um start my YouTube channel. I have a right to um exercise my gifts and my talents to improve on my gifts and my talents, my into my intuitive gifts. Like this is this is justice. It, um, the universe is for me and not against me. And this justice energy. Yeah, somebody's putting in work to come up against me. Um, I also heard they want to put behind them emotional regrets and losses. So they're coming up against me to make them own to make their own self feel better. Whoever this person is, they're putting in work because they want to leave this behind them. So they're taking their issues out on me or trying to. Then we got the Ten of Cups. Somebody could be doing this to prove a point. Um, this could be somebody, this, um, this could be somebody's religion. Like voodoo could be somebody's religion. Somebody could be, a, um, these people could be devil worship, worshipers. This is like their religion. Um... There also can be a man coming up against me because I guess I could have offended his uh, a, a woman in his life. There could be a man coming up against me because I offended a woman in his life. I don't know who this woman is. So I guess it's a man that's coming up against me because I, I call some female emotional regrets and losses. So he feels as though is his is um he's putting in work to defeat me. I don't know I don't know exactly what this is. To be honest with you, I don't even think I personally personally know these people. I'm also picking up these people that gang stalk in my channel. They can also be very prejudiced. Um, not they're not prejudiced about the color of my skin. This is prejudicism concerning success. These people don't like successful people or confident people. So it's like this is what they do for a living. This is what will make this person happy. Um, it could be a couple coming up against me. Like, they're the ringleaders of this gang stalking. It could be a couple. And, like, this woman is telling this man to defeat me to make her feel better or something. For, like, their ten of cups. Or something like that going on. Oh, boy. Then we got the high priestess in reverse. Yeah. Yeah. Um... Whoever five cups, whoever is five cups, um, secrets could, could have been revealed or somebody not intuitive. Somebody's not intuitive. Somebody has emotional regrets and losses because secrets was revealed or somebody wasn't intuitive. I don't know if in one of my readings I could have offended somebody. So they just decided to come up against me like in the worst way. Somebody's lover, this woman. 
So this woman could have went to her her lover. Um, I'm picking up that this woman is not as skilled in the occult as this man is. It could be an earth sign man. I don't know. But she had to go to him and she was complaining about me. And she was telling this man to come up against me. Because I made her feel like the high priestess in reverse. Or I revealed a secret about her. Or something like that. This couple can be married. The Ten of Cups. They're probably married. It's an earth sign. The man could be an earth sign. And his lover or his wife or whatever this is. She could be a, a, a water sign. Maybe a Pisces or a Cancer. So it's a this masculine. It's a masculine. <clears throat> so that's what's going on. Somebody was watching my readings and they got highly upset about one of my readings. Somebody got highly upset and then they started putting the work in to offend me. But they're like putting their, it's like these people is putting their own self in danger to come up against me. They're doing this to their self. What's going on with the high priestess in reverse? What is the high priestess in reverse telling me? Somebody was trying to, mm. somebody, I heard somebody want me to go away. They want my channel to go away. They just want me to go away. <clears throat> Somebody's no longer sure about how to get their wish fulfillment. They could be trying to figure out how to, how to um, defeat me. Somebody's having a hard time with their wish fulfillment. Nine of Cups coming out sideways. That's what. The, that's why the High Priestess is in reverse. Because somebody's secrets either got revealed or somebody is like not intuitive. Or somebody is fake. The High Priestess in reverse could be somebody that's fake. The high priestess in reverse could be like a false prophet. So maybe these people feel as though that, I, that I'm a false prophet and I should be stopped. Because I'm. they feel as though I'm a false prophet, they're saying put an ending to me because their wish fulfillment is not going to get granted if I have a channel. So they want to put an ending to me. Because their wish fulfillment is, they feel as though I'm stopping or blocking their wish fulfillment. But what I just heard too, I'm matching the universe's energy. Like the universe has nothing against me. I didn't do nothing wrong. Because of my energy. Like I'm I'm matching the universe's energy. Because they the cards told me this is me. And this is the, the universe justice. So my energy is red. It's like I'm I'm in alignment. I'm in alignment with the universe. So they could be saying that I'm a false prophet, but I never even claim to be a prophet. I don't consider myself a, a prophet. They feel as though I'm a false prophet. The high priest is in reverse. Is this what they're saying about me? The high priest is in reverse. Yeah. So somebody has emotional regrets and losses because they feel as though I'm a false prophet. I never said when I I never said in none of my readings claim to be a prophet. But they they're saying I'm the high priestess in reverse. So they're saying I'm not intuitive. I'm a false prophet. And um, what I'm doing is, is whatever I'm doing or something that I said, they feel as though I'm, it's hard for them to get their wish fulfillment because of my YouTube channel. So they're coming up against me. 
That's what this is. It's hard for them to get their wish fulfillment. Okay, so spirit, what's their wish fulfillment? Okay, the chariot. So they want a victory. This is their wish fulfillment. The chariot. The chariot can also be warfare. So it's like these people want to defeat me and they want it to just happen. They want to just be able to defeat me and defeat me. Like they don't want it to be adversity. Like they hit me and I hit them back or they just want them. They just want to be able to hit me and I not hit back. Like, that's the type of energy I'm picking up on. So, basically, they don't want me to be defended. They don't want me to be protected. They just want a victory. They just want to be able to do whatever they want to do to me and just do it. So, they want a victory. They want a victory. But with what, though? With what? They're having a hard time getting a victory because they're saying I'm a false prophet. Okay. Um, let me see. Let me put some um. No, let me put some tea on this. Let me put some tea. All right, tell me the tea about this the chariot energy. Tell me the tea. What specifically is this victory? What what is this? Tell me the tea. Photo proof getting getting evident. Oh. So they want to get. They're trying to. Get, uh, maybe they want a picture of me. They probably want a picture. They want to see what I look like. They want me to show my face. Oh, okay. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So I'm going to be honest. I'm going to be honest with y'all. All right. This, this, what I'm about to say, this is for the people that watch my channel that sincerely, that don't have no ill will towards me. Um, like I said, these people have been attacking my channel since I started my channel. I started my channel December the 6th, I think, in 2020. In 2020. December 2020. So, two year, almost two years ago. So, that's one of the reasons why. Because I pick up on the gang stalking and, and, and the witchcraft. I pick it up intuitively. And that's one of the reasons why I won't show my face. That's one of the reasons why. So, they claim that I'm not intuitive and that, that I'm a false prophet. So, they want me to show my face. They want to see what I look like. So, they need, they need a picture of me. Huh. So, they can get a victory or something. They want to see what I look like. So whatever type of witchcraft, dark magic they're doing, it's not enough. They need a picture of me to like, I guess, to officially defeat me. They need a picture. And it's funny too, because I was thinking the other day that um, I, w I was about to post a picture of me. Or I was thinking that it's about that time that, you know, I let you guys see what I look like. But because of the gang stalking and certain things, and it's other things as well, it's just not this. It's just not drama. It's I have my reasons why I don't show my face. I have my reasons. But this drama is just one of the reasons. But they want photo proof. They want to get some type of evidence against me. It's like they're saying I'm a liar, I'm a false prophet, I'm not intuitive, but they're trying to get evidence. So they want to get evidence, and they have, they want to get evidence? That's the T. Tell me more about this evidence. 
Tell me more. Give me the tea about this evidence that they want to get. Tell me more about this evidence. Oh, okay, impersonator. Wants to be you, acts like, dresses like, looks like, copies you. Hmm. They want a victory concerning proof and evidence. Some of this energy is they want to see my face. They want to see what I look like. They want a picture of me. And I asked, I wanted more information about this evidence. They're saying I'm an impersonator. They, they're they saying that I'm, I'm an impersonator. And they're trying to get proof that I'm an impersonator. I want to be like somebody... I act like somebody, I dress like somebody, I look like somebody, or I'm copying somebody. That's what they're saying. And they want to get proof. Or they want to get they want to get some type of evidence from me so they can impersonate me or something like that. Oh boy. And then we got shine, yeah. Your light irritates their demons, which I already knew that. My light irritates their demons. But anyway, give me the spell about this high priestess in reverse. This is crazy. So this is like a couple, but that's just one scenario. All right. I'm also picking up this woman is saying this woman is telling this man to do what they have to do to affect my energy so that y'all can see so that they can see my face. She wants a picture of me. She wants a picture of me. This woman, she just saying, get her to show her face, get her to show her face. That's what she's telling this man to do. So. Like I said, whoever this woman is, she's not as experienced in like witchcraft and things like that as this Eight of Pentacles is. She's not as experienced. And he's doing it because this could be his family member. This woman has five cups. This is his family member or his wife or whatever. It's ten cups. Or he really care about this woman. And I, I guess I offended her or something. Give me the spell on this high priestess coming out in reverse. Okay, bestie. One who is always by your side, who never ditches you, and who would take a bullet for you. Hmm. I already kind of knew that. So, basically, these people that's gang stalking me, they want me to believe that Everything is just normal, but I know intuitively that it's not. So it's like the people that's gang stalking me, they want me to like believe that they um their intentions for me is good. Um things like that. Like when they give me likes, um, when they give me a lot of views, they want me to feel as though that they're with me and not against me. So it's like something to do with bestie. Oh. So the eight of pentacles and the five of cups, they could be best friends. So I could have offended somebody's friend. Or this is a married couple. Yeah, I said that these people is putting their life in danger to come up against me. One who is always by your side, who never ditches you, and who would take a bullet for you. Yeah. Somebody is putting their life in danger to, like, get 
to like uh defeat me for that for their spouse or their best friend or something so somebody is best friends they're best friends or they want me to feel as though they cool with me even though i can't see them because they're you know this is technology I know intuitively that some of my subscribers and viewers, their karmics, I already know. I already know. And they want me to feel as though <laughs> they subscribe to my channel or they give me views that everything cool. But I pick up certain things intuitively. <laughs> All right. What's the spell with... um? Or I don't know. Some I don't know. Give me this fill with the five of cups and the high priestess in reverse. Give me this fill. The fourth house. One sense of security, family, siblings, parents, ancestor, ancestry, heritage, roots, one's housing and comfort. So the fourth house. Okay, so that's cancer. So somebody could be a cancer. Yeah, this this female that feels offended by me, she could be a cancer. And I heard she just want to be her normal self again. Something, I guess, that I did, she don't feel herself again because she she hasn't been herself since I had a YouTube channel or since she stumbled across my YouTube channel. She feels as though she's not going to be herself again unless my YouTube channel is no more. That's what this woman is saying. Or whoever this woman is, she... Whoever this woman is, she wants to confirm something. She thinks that she know me, but she's not sure. This woman probably think like I'm her long lost friend or something. So this woman wants to see my face. She want to see my face. So I don't know if this woman think that I'm somebody that offended her and like went on a run or something. She's telling this man to put in work because she wants to see my face. But it's witchcraft. It's like spell work. They want to like influence me to show my face on camera. This is crazy. She want to be herself again. She feels as though I offended her. I did something to her. And she's not going to be herself again until I'm defeated. The fourth house. One sense of security. Or somebody feels as though I did something to their family, a sibling, their parents or something, or their ancestry. Or their roots. Or something to do with their housing. Somebody tried to, Somebody feel as though I offended their fourth house. But this can be like concerning intuition. I offended somebody intuitively. But I'm picking up. I don't even know this. I don't know this feminine energy. I don't know this woman. But she thinks that she know me. So I don't know if something could have happened in her country or something. And her best friend offended her and then her best friend disappeared or something. And she think I'm her best friend or something. I don't know. This is crazy. Or somebody, somebody think I'm somebody. I remind somebody of somebody and it like scares them. I'm picking that up too. Oh boy. Give me the spill on this nine of cups coming out sideways with the chariot and photo proof it impersonator. Somebody thinks I'm doing something to them. <laughs> on purpose and I'm not. I don't even know this woman. 
So I don't know if I sound like somebody to this woman. And it's like she can't take it no more. It's driving her crazy. She wants to know who I am. She's telling this man, get a picture of her. This girl is driving me crazy. Or something like that. This woman bugging. Give me the spoon. On this energy. Nine of cups sideways. The chariot photo proof and impersonator. Always partying, playing games. So somebody think I'm playing? Some Somebody thinks I'm somebody, but I'm not that person. So I'm even picking up that somebody, this, this, something could have happened to this woman's best friend and this woman has been missing and she wants to know if I'm her. She wants to know if I'm her best friend that went missing, but I'm not. So she feels like I'm tormenting her. Somebody think I'm their long lost like best friend or something. This woman going crazy a little bit. Yeah, she's going crazy a little bit. And it's like a lot of people getting involved. It's a lot. It's a lot of them. It's a lot of people getting involved. Um, always partying and playing games. This woman could be getting karma. This woman could be getting karma because she's the one who's always partying and playing games. And I don't, I don't too much play games. Or this is confirming that they're gang stalking me, playing games. So I'm also picking up somebody think I'm gang stalking them. So they're going to gang stalk me and, and like attempt to like do overkill. Because somebody think I did something to them. So they're going to do it to me. And then they're going to do it like 10 times over. So this is crazy. What's the spill with the Eight of Pentacles? And it's, give me the spill on this Eight, ten, eight of Pentacles. No. Give me, let me do the tea first. Give me the tea with this Eight of Pentacles. Yeah, a fake smile. Yeah. Mm -hmm. These people fake. Some of my uh, returning viewers, all of these karmics, all of them is not subscribed to my channel. But some of them are. These people that are gang stalking me, they're fake. And they want me to fall for it, but I'm not dumb. I'm very intuitive. I pick up on their energy through technology. I pick it up. Um, so somebody's putting in work to be fake. And like I said, when I first started my channel, they used to dislike my videos. So it was like 10 dislikes, 20 dislikes. When I didn't respond to that, that's when they stopped. So they did that for like six months. They just would hit this like, this like, this like, this like. So I didn't respond to that. I just let them do it. So they stopped doing it and they started doing other stuff. Yeah, so they're putting in work to be fake. And like I said, they do certain things to my channel and I pick it up intuitively and I know it. So I won't show I won't show my face just because just because because I know they're being fake. <clears throat> or whatever happened to this feminine energy that I'm picking up on this five of cups, whatever happened to her, her this person that's eight pentacles coming up against me, it was actually them that did it to her. So this woman is not intuitive. Somebody's claiming that I'm fake, I'm a false prophet, and I'm not intuitive. And this woman is like going to the Eight of Pentacles. Whatever happened to this woman, she's saying I did it to her, but I didn't do nothing to her. The Eight of Pentacles could have did it. So the Eight of Pentacles is coming up against me, being fake. Because the Eight of Pentacles know that they the one who did it. I don't know what happened to this woman. But the Eight of Pentacles probably know. 
So it's like the Eight of Pentacles, like, what happened? And the Five of Cups, like, oh, Blood Queen Tarot did this or she's doing that. And because she's doing this, we're not going to get our wish fulfillment. And the Eight of Pentacles is like, don't worry about it. I'll fix it. I, I'll, I'll make sure her channel is not successful. I'll fix it. But whatever happened to the Five of Cups, the Eight of Pentacles did it. And the Eight of Pentacles could be like more experienced in like voodoo or the occult. <laughs> this is crazy. And that's why justice is here in my energy. That's why justice is here. So the Five of Cups is saying, I'm a false prophet and I'm not intuitive, but it's not me. It's her. Because she's interacting with a fake friend. I didn't do nothing to that. And I didn't do nothing to the Five of Cups. So I don't know if the Five of Cups is saying that I was gang stalking her channel or something like that. Or she thinks that I'm like a fugitive or something. <laughs> Something like that going on at five of cups. She bugging. Um, <laughs> what's the tea? what's the tea with the six of wands and justice? Okay, we got fake flexing. Axe rich flosses money. Axe fancy shows off. All right. <clears throat> So something could be being brought to my attention or I'm getting a victory over like fake flexing. These people could be fake or something. And me just being who I am, they feel as though I'm fake, but I'm not. I'm just being who I am. Axe rich flosses money, axe fancy shows off. Or they feel as though I'm a show off or something. So, the Six of Wands could be a victory. So, I could be getting a victory over, like, fake flexing. These people are saying, I'm an impersonator. I'm a false prophet. I'm not intuitive. But, it's really them. And it's not me. So, I'm getting a victory over somebody who was fake flexing. Or something like that. And justice is here. Like, the universe agree with me, or whatever this is, or the universe is, like, protecting me. Because this is, like, it's like I heard spirits say the five of cups need to look, shouldn't look too far. The five of cups is blaming me. I, I live where I live at. The five of, okay, I live in America. The five of cups probably live in, like, China or Africa somewhere. I don't know this woman, the five of cups, whoever she is. But she think that I used to be like her neighbor or something. This woman don't even know who I am. Or something like that. I don't know what in the world is going on. Somebody feel as though they know me or they saw me somewhere or I did spell work on them or something. But it wasn't me who did this to them. It was somebody close to home. It's one of their fake friends. It wasn't me. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god <laughs> okay what's the spell <laughs> what's the tea with the eight of pentacles and the ten of cups what's the tea yeah yeah somebody's trying to get me rejected from something this can even be from youtube Somebody don't want me to have my YouTube channel. Um, it's their wish fulfillment. It would be their ten of cups, their happiness. It would make them emotionally, or emotionally happy for me to get rejected or for my channel to be shut down or something like that. Or the five of cups. Maybe the five of cups had a YouTube channel. And something happened to her channel and she think I did it. So they want me to get rejected, but they're having a hard time doing it. Oh my God. Yeah, somebody wants me to get rejected. Or they're, or they're accusing me of fake flexing. <laughs> they could be accusing me of fake flexing. Oh my God. 
Give me the spell with the eight of pentacles. Give me the spell with this eight of pentacles. Yeah, for the cloud. Doing it, doing it all for the fame, attention, views. Doesn't want to be left alone being fake. So like I said, this could be a couple, a karmic couple. Or maybe this woman is dating her false twin. Or something like that going on. And they trying to take their anger out on me. Out on me. But the Eight of Pentacles is not really coming for me because he they feel as though I did something to the Five of Cups. The Eight of Pentacles, no, I didn't do no harm to the Five of Cups. So whatever the Eight of Pentacles is doing against my YouTube channel, they're doing it for the cloud. Because the Eight of Pentacles know what the truth is. Whatever this is, that Eight of Pentacles know. So the Eight of Pentacles coming up against me, wanting me to get rejected, the Eight of Pentacles is doing it for the cloud. Or the Eight of Pentacles want the approval of the Five of Cups. To make the Five of Cups feel better. So the Eight of Pentacles is putting in work to come up against me. Because the Eight of Pentacles want the Five of Cups to go to the Ten of Cups. Something like that. What's the spell? With the Eight of Pentacles, the Ten of Cups... Um, Fake smiles and rejected coming out sideways. What is this still with this? Yeah, a toxic connection. Yeah. These two lovers, I don't know what this is. This could be family or lovers. These two know each other. The Five of Cups and the Eight of Pentacles, they know each other. But their connection is to toxic. And I think the Five of Cups don't want to accept it. Because she's not intuitive, but she's saying I'm not intuitive. But it's really her. She could be dealing with her false twin. The Five of Cups could be interacting with her false twin. But she's telling her false twin to come up against me. Their relationship involves constant fighting on thin ice with each other, but trying to maintain the relationship. Okay. All right, what's the spill? Give me the spill with the six of wands, because this is my energy. Give me the spill with the six of wands. Okay, so energy drainer. It kind of came out sideways. So they probably feel as though I drained their energy. All right, so, okay, the Six of Wands could also be telling me I'm I'm getting a victory over these gang stalkers, my karmic viewers, subscribers, and or their returning viewers. These gang stalkers, I could be getting a victory over them trying to drain my energy, or they're saying that I drain their energy or something. Give me the spill with the six of wands and just give me a spill with justice. Yeah, ignored. Yeah. Yeah. So I'm supposed to ignore this drama. I'm supposed to ignore it. They don't like when I when I ignore them. Or they want me to always rant and rave on my channel about whatever they're doing or something. They want me to give them attention. Um It's like justice for somebody to get ignored or be ignored. And that's what the Six of Wands is doing. It's like I got my back turned to the Eight of Pentacles and the Five of Cups. So this is karmic justice for them, for me to ignore them, not pay them any attention, to not feel threatened or intimidated by their witchcraft or dark magic or them gang stalking me. I'm supposed to ignore them. It's karmic justice. Whatever this is. <clears throat> or it's a false like couple out here. Uh, this, this man could have offended this woman. 
But this woman so not intuitive. She think I did something and I didn't. But the most high is aware that this man did something to this karmic female. But the karmic female want to blame it on me and or my channel. But the universe, no, I didn't do it. It was this karmic masculine. So it's like this karmic masculine is getting karma. Because this karmic female could be ignoring him. And this karmic female is saying, I'm not having sex with you or we're not getting married or something. This karmic female is saying, if you can't defeat Blood Queen, then something this karmic female is saying. And she's ignoring this karmic masculine. This karmic female is ignoring this karmic masculine until he like defeat me or something. So this karmic masculine is putting in hella work to like defeat me and or my channel. And spirit is telling me, ignore the whole thing. Ignore it because this is kind of like dumb. This has nothing to do with me. I probably don't even know these people. But this woman could be a karmic. She's five cups and she's not intuitive. And she's saying, I'm not intuitive. Something like that is going on. This woman, this karmic female wants this karmic masculine to do something to me. Or she could be saying that. Or I don't know if they could be trying to cipher my energy. This karmic female probably needs like vitality. She could be sick or something. And they could be trying to cipher my energy to give it to her or something they doing. Something they trying to do. I don't know. I, I don't know. But um, the cards is telling me it's karmic justice for um, this karmic masculine to get ignored. So something is happening the way it's supposed to happen because somebody getting karma. And it's like spirit, unbeknownst to me, spirit is kind of like using me to give them karma. So it kind of like really has nothing to do with me. And that's probably why I've been ignoring it. Or this karmic masculine told this karmic female that I was the one who did something, but it wasn't me. It was him. So it's like I'm ignoring this karmic masculine and this karmic female is ignoring this karmic masculine. So because he was trying to lie to cover something up, it's like he's getting, he's not getting a victory, victory with me or his karmic lover or his karmic friend, whoever this woman is. This woman could be his family. This karmic female could be this karmic masculine's parents, family, siblings or something like that. So this karmic female is ignoring this karmic masculine. And I'm ignoring both of them. And spirit is telling me that's that's justice. That's me doing the right thing. Like pay this no mind. Somebody could be deranged because they have toxic ways. Weird, strange, and twisted individual. Toxic ways, bad habits, addictions. Can't stay away from harmful, harmful substances. So these people be doing stuff. They doing stuff. I'm, I heard they're saturated with like um, death rituals and like sac they're saturated with like voodoo. They're saturated with this. So they a little bit crazy. These people are crazy and deranged. Um, I also want to say concerning gang stalking on my channel. So I can make it. I just be very careful what I say. Um... I know it's groups and they do it in sections. I don't know exactly how they do it, but I know it's a group of like five to six. And then it's like a group of like between 30 and 40. And then it's like a group of like 200 to like 350. It's like, they, it's like they come in clusters. It's like clusters. They come in, they come in clusters, but I don't think they're all connected. They just do it in groups. Whatever they do, they do it in groups. Um, and I'm aware it's a group of like maybe five and then it's a group of between 30 and 40 and then it's a group between 200 to like 350. 
and they gang stalk and do witchcraft and dark magic on my channel. So it's like clusters, like they do it in clusters and groups. And they feel as though I'm not intuitive. Or this karmic masculine. <laughs> this karmic female could have got exposed. And this karmic masculine is like a weird that this karmic female got exposed. <laughs> and it's like he won't just say to her, just accept it, you a karmic. He's like trying to defeat me to like kiss her behind. But this man know that this woman is not intuitive or she's a false prophet. This karmic masculine, the eight of pentacles is aware that the five of cups is fake and phony. But the five of cups is telling the eight of pentacles to come up against me. Because she don't like something that I did or said in one of my readings or something. So that could be going on too. And then we got daydreaming of you. Someone cannot get you off their mind, attracted to you, constantly thinks of being with you romantically. So, I don't know. This karmic masculine, whoever the eight of pentacles is, they can have like a crush on me or something. It's like, it's like this, the eight of pentacles want to see my face just wrote for, out of romance, romantic reasons. The eight of pentacles could have a crush on me. And he could be the karmic masculine. The five of cups is this karmic female. She want a picture of me for a totally different reason. Like, she want to do some dark magic or whatever. But he want a picture of me for a totally different reason. So this is like crazy. Or this is like a married couple acting stupid. And spirit is telling me they're getting karma and ignore them. It's like these people don't want me to know that they're getting karma. All I know is that they're gang stalking me. But they're gang stalking me because they're getting karma. So spirit telling me ignore them. Don't like don't make a big deal out, of, deal out of it because they're gang stalking you because they're getting karma they can be like unhappily married they're miserable or something like that their marriage could be i just heard their marriage could be hanging on by a thread so they want me to feel as though my youtube channel is hanging on by a thread or something like that. Yeah. This justice energy. This could be a married couple out here. That could be coming up against me. My channel. Yeah. <clears throat> Alright. What's the scoop with the six of wands with justice? Energy drainer, fake, flexing, and ignore it. So spirit is basically telling me keep going, don't stop. Ignore this energy that I'm picking up intuitively because these people be fake flexing and they are energy drainers. So just ignore them. Give me the scoop on this energy. So these people can have earth in a chart. They can have water in a chart. They're earth, they could be earth signs and water signs for the majority of them. Gratitude, show more gratitude. All right. So they probably want me to show more gratitude or something. They probably feel as though I'm very disrespectful or something. Or um, the most high is just telling me to be thankful and ignore them. Just continue to do me. Show more gratitude to be thankful that their spell work had can't work against me or whatever show more gratitude or they want me to show them more gratitude or they want me to show them more respect or something or something or spirit is just telling me to be thankful so like after this reading spirit want me to let this go 
show more gratitude. I don't have to do another reading or whatever about this gang stalking. Spirit wants me to be thankful. And that's it, period. I really don't even have to do this reading. All right. What's the scoop with? I mean, I just heard Spirit say, I'm for real. Literally, ignore them. That's justice. That's karmic justice. So even me doing this reading is giving them like energy to come up against me or something. Like I literally, I literally need to show more gratitude to the most high. Be thankful to the towards the most high the universe. And that's it. Okay. All right, so. Okay, what's the scoop with the Eight of Pentacles, the Ten of Cups, fake smiles, rejected sideways, and toxic connection? Yeah, arrested, transformation, yeah. Someone may be getting arrested. These people or whoever are the leaders of this gang stalking, somebody might be getting arrested or they wanted me to get arrested, 3D or 5D. Transformation, things are changing in your life. So, somebody might be getting arrested because things are changing in, in my life. They wanted something to go one way for me, but it's going to go the total opposite of whatever their intentions was on gang stalking my channel. Disrespecting my channel, playing games with my channel. So somebody's going to get arrested 3D or 5D. Or this is what they wanted to happen to me. They wanted me to get arrested 3D or 5D and probably pass away. I don't know if these people wanted me to get arrested and um, um, pass away in jail. Or they wanted me to pass away in my sleep or something. I don't know if they wanted me to astro travel or something. They wanted me to pass away in my sleep. Something like that. Someone may be getting arrested. Things are changing in your life. Yeah. All right. Give me the scoop with this five of cups. Give me the scoop with the five of cups alone. Projection. Yeah. This woman, whoever the five of cups is, this woman or these people, um, they project their issues off on me. Your life is a projection of the energy you are putting out. So this woman, something happened to the five of cups and they want to blame it on me. But I had nothing to do with it. Whatever happened to the five of cups, a secret coming out or somebody finding out that somebody's not intuitive, it had nothing to do with me. Whoever is five of cups is the high priestess in reverse because their life is a projection of the energy they're putting out. But they want to blame something on me. Or they want to say I'm the reason why they're not getting their wish fulfillment. Or this woman is saying I'm the reason why this man won't propose to her. Or why he's cheating on her. Because maybe this karmic masculine listen to my YouTube, listen to my readings or something. Yeah, so, and then we have childish. Someone is being very childish, yeah. So this woman is trying to project her energy off on me. Whatever type of karma this woman got, she want to blame it on me. And she's saying, I'm the reason why she's not getting her wish fulfillment. Or she's saying, I'm, on, I'm just like me being a tarot reader that I play too much. Or I'm always partying or I play too much or something. But it's really her or something. So, give me the scoop. On the five of cups, the high priestess in reverse. Bestie, fourth house. Nine, nine of cups sideways. The chariot and all this other stuff over here. Yeah, emer submerged emotions. Someone's feelings run really deep, but they are concealed. Hmm. So somebody really don't like me. Or maybe this female, she probably got a crush on me or something. 
or this female go both ways, or somebody just hate my guts. Somebody really don't like me. Someone's feelings run really deep, but they are concealed. Whoever is five cups, this person want me to get karma. They want my channel shut down. They want to see what I look like. This person is not happy. And they 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 want to blame something on me that I didn't even do to them. Whatever karma or something that the Five of Cups got, it could have been because she was fake flexing, fake flexing or they were fake, fake flexing. This is why somebody is Five Cups because they were fake flexing. But they want to say they're Five Cups because I'm a liar or I'm like not intuitive or I'm a false prophet. That's not why this person is Five Cups. They Five Cups because they be fake flexing and they're an energy drainer. Something like that going on. And the universe is like, justice is like, no. We know what really happened and no. We read minds. Justice is saying we read minds and we read, we read hearts and, and we read minds. That brain and that heart. So justice is saying no. I know what really, really happened. I read minds and I read hearts. So, I know Blood Queen Tarot did nothing to you. I know what the truth is. In spite of what you're telling your karmic masculine, I know what the, the truth is. That's what Justice is saying. Because I heard Justice say, I read minds and I read hearts. So, whatever this person or these people trying to do, Justice is saying no. Because Justice is like, I read minds and I read hearts. And I know what happened. Then we got Black Magic. See? Someone has been using Dark Magic. Yep. Yeah. So these people could have also been accusing me of doing dark magic. And Justice is saying Blood Queen didn't. She did not. In spite of what you think, this Five of Cups think I do dark magic or something. All right. Give me a, do I want to do a charm card? Yeah, give me a charm card for the Six of Wands, Justice, and this energy with the Six of Wands and Justice. Give me a charm card, and then I'm going to be done. Give me a charm card. Give me a charm card. Yeah, safety can repair. Hmm. So this could be telling me that my channel is going to be repaired in spite of their whatever type of damage that they did do is going to be repaired. The safety pin, something is going to be put back together in its rightful place, in its rightful position. Yeah. Or um, these people wanted to repair something at my expense. So I could be getting a victory over somebody wanting to heal their own heart at my expense. Um, I did not cause them heartbreak. I did not wound these people. I did not do anything to them. I heard I didn't do nothing to these people that they didn't do to themselves first. So something could have happened to these people and I just picked up on their energy and confirmed it. I just heard that. I didn't do nothing to these people that they didn't do to themselves first. So... This could be something like something happened, somebody got karma, and I picked it up in one of my readings, and then they just came for my head. Like something like that. But somebody wanted to heal their broken heart or to repair something at my expense. So I could be getting a victory over that. And the universe is making sure of that. Give me a charm card for the Eight of Pentacles and um, the Ten of Cups. And this energy with the Eight of Pentacles and Ten of Cups. <clears throat> so, whatever happened to the Five of Cups, if this is like the 3D, this is crazy. Whatever happened to the Five of Cups, they, somebody could have been trying to get me arrested. <laughs> somebody could have been trying to get me arrested. But this is crazy. Yeah, we got Locket Sentimental. 
Nghe em So I don't know if somebody wanted me to feel sorry for them Or something Sentimental Oh yeah Somebody want to somebody wanna know what I look like. <laughs> somebody want to know what I look like. I guess they wanted me to, me to be the object of like a sentiment or something to be sentimental over. Like, oh, that happened to her. Oh, my God. <laughs> so that's what they wanted. Something like that. Give me a charm card for the five of cups and this high priestess in reverse. I don't know if these people wanted me to feel sorry for myself. And they wanted me to do something for Cloud. Like, do it all. <laughs> I don't know. Give me a charm card for the Five of Cups of High Priestess. Yeah, skills and bite. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So, somebody feel as though they can't, um, like, master their skills because of me. Or it's like I said, somebody somebody could be a tarot reader and this person is not allowed on YouTube no more. This person can't make a YouTube channel or something. And I don't know if this person think that I did it. I don't know what's wrong with this person that's five cups. So somebody feels as though they're having a hard time perfecting their skills because of me. That's how somebody feel. But it's not me. It could be their karmic lover. Somebody's karmic lover could be doing spell work on them and they want to blame it on me. That's that's basically what this is in a nutshell. And then you got other people that's getting involved. Or something like that. Um... Yeah, I'm hearing it again. Somebody feel as though they cannot perfect their craft because of me. They want to blame it on me. Somebody's having a hard time perfecting their craft because they feel they want to blame it on me. Or somebody is not able to impersonate me how they want to because they feel they I play all the time. Maybe they don't like the fact that I laugh in my readings. So it's something about me being like down to earth or I laugh a lot. It's something about me doing that, that this person is hard for them to impersonate me. Or it's hard for them to say that I impersonate them because I have my own personality or something. Or something this person was trying to do. But they're having a hard time with their skills or something. Or they wanted me to have a hard time with mine. They wanted me to have a hard time. Or something like that. So I'm going to end it. So that's what I have going on. Yeah. <clears throat> yeah. Somebody could be trying to defend their friend against me or something. Somebody feel as though I did something to their friend. Or something's going to be sweet for me in the spring. Some type of friendship in the spring. Or something might be sweet for me in the spring. Some type of friendship in the spring. That's going to happen. Yeah, something. Well, we got black magic. Somebody could have got kicked out. Because I could have got hired or something. You're hired. So somebody got kicked out. Or somebody tried to hire somebody to kick me off YouTube. <laughs> and it was it was black magic. Somebody hired somebody to kick me off YouTube. <laughs> or something. Or somebody feel as though I got them evicted. But it's sad because for some of this energy with the five of cups, I'm picking up. I don't even live in the same country as this person. And they're blaming something on me. And I don't even live in their country. <laughs> so 
So it's like I could have started my YouTube channel and then this other person could have got kicked off YouTube and they could be trying to say I did it. I booted them off. So I'm going to give an example. Okay, I think, I'm not sure. I got to double check. But I think I started my YouTube channel December 6th, 2020. So say like I started my YouTube channel December 6th. This person got noticed that they're no longer allowed on YouTube on December 6th. Like something like that. Somebody is like very suspicious. They're not intuitive. This person is suspicious. So I just heard that too. Because they do too much black magic. Yeah. So I heard somebody is superstitious. They're not intuitive. So something like that could have happened. So, again, I'm going to say it again. Somebody could be very suspicious of me and they're coming up against me because something could have happened by coincidence. And they're superstitious. They're not intuitive. So, like I said, it, I started my channel December 6, 2020. This person could have got kicked off YouTube December 6, 2020. So, this person just automatically assumed that I did something or something like that. So let me end it. So that's what I have to let this. This is like part two from um, the reading that I started um, earlier today. I just had to finish it because I had things to do. So this is part two concerning my channel being like gang stalked and things like that. So for all those of you who are like sincerely like have no ill intent towards me. I just want to say thank you guys and I really appre appreciate you guys. Um... So, I'm going to end it. This is Blood Queen Tarot. Please don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and or share. And thank you.